I'm Mike with Mortgage Inspection Services, and I want to talk to you about something that there's a lot of confusion about. It's ground rods and grounded outlets. Uh, during home inspections, I often come across an ungrounded outlet or a home full of ungrounded outlets. And I'm often asked the question by real estate agents or the buyers if installing a ground rod will ground the outlets in the home. And the answer is no. And it may seem rather odd, but ground rods and grounded outlets are essentially unrelated, except for the fact that they have to do with electricity. There's really no relation between the two, and I'll explain why. So a ground rod is used um, by the electrical system to give away for stray voltages to dissipate into the earth rather than causing all kinds of havoc with your home's electrical system, with your TVs, your computers and things. A grounded outlet, on the other hand, is used to clear a fault if you have a piece of uh, damaged equipment plugged in. Let me give an example. Let's say you have a washing machine and inside that washing machine somewhere a wire has come loose and it's touching the frame or the body of the washing machine. That will make the entire washing machine energized. Now if somebody were to walk up to that washing machine to put a load of laundry in and they touch that lid, they could potentially be electrocuted. So what the ground wire does is the minute that, or the very second that that uh, wire comes loose and touches the body of the washing machine, it, send, it basically creates a short circuit and through the ground wire, a high current runs back to the breaker panel. And that current is many times higher than the rated amperage of the breaker that's protecting the washing machine. So that breaker immediately trips and kills the power to that washing machine. So now if somebody were to walk up to the washing machine, uh, they're no longer in danger of being electrocuted. Now obviously that washing machine can't be used because the breaker's stripped, but at least nobody's going to get electrocuted. So in summary, a ground rod protects the equipment in the home from outside voltages, from stray voltages, such as a lightning strike or a voltage surge on the power lines. A grounded outlet is designed to protect people from uh, being electrocuted due to a faulty piece of equipment plugged in. I hope that clears up a little bit of the confusion. If you have any questions or comments, please let me know below and I'll do my best to answer them. Thank you.